So in order for us to support our structure here, we need something like a huge post and you can see here this is actually a dead body or branch of a kamachili and I remember before I cut this and I carry it until here yet I first have excavated like up to hit deep um, part of the soil and after that I submerged this it was heavy because it was newly cut so because of that if you can notice you know it you cannot you cannot move because I submerged it with many um, including with many many soil with voluminous soil and with rocks so that it will become stronger and also we are you know we are happy that even if it died a branch emerge and this one it is it starts to grow so we are hopeful that in the near future when this one eventually will will die there is something that serves as a replacement and we're just going to trim so that it will go straight and it will provide us a, a structure that is well supported and a structure that is well built and strong so that's what we are uh, expecting here and because of the presence of this post you know that pole towards that pole it became strong and that made our structure also here stable so even if you are going to climb from here you can climb and I am usually climbing because I remember also there are fruits that grew here before so moving on to our update of our squash right now so I recalled this one I re recall this I rerouted this because it went towards direction towards the many competitors and it will not be healthy for this one because there are many competitors so when I recalled the length of this was up to here but now wow it, it already reached towards the summit of you know of our rope and there you see there is a fruit that one wow. so happy to see that ah and this one also there is a fruit wow so happy to see this also so this huge branch here is actually coming from a far far source it bent towards here aha uh -huh. and this one also has a has a fruit uh -huh. the fruit is circular actually uh -huh. or heart shape now later on you'll be seeing that it is heart shape oh uh -huh. so thankfully and you know even though our posts here are actually lowly i mean movable but we have like the center post here which is stronger so even if this is like lowly this one also is lowly it's not that strong we we didn't exert so much effort to make it stronger because we are confident that the central pole is stable stable and this one is just like i mean are just like a support uh, structure here even this one i tried to utilize again because this is about to to collapse the body got uh, rotten already and it was so dry and there was like a cliff here that is why we need to add more soil and another structure another um, fresh kamachari branch that I cut so I put it nearby so that all together you know the two are being 
put together so that it will become strong so this time around oh go go this one you can see that she is happy because she seemed to be showing her prominence up there but I need to guide them to go somewhere else okay mm -hmm. to go back <laughs> or else they are going to be <clears throat> uh, pointing down and we don't want that to to happen so this one oh what happened to you this one become become so sad <laughs> I don't know okay perhaps because of you know the scarcity of water <clears throat> it became so lowly no okay so this time around oh I also feel right now the itchiness of you know the squash leaves and what happened to you yeah you just have to go there uh-huh so we really need to have a manipulation here the caretaker should be manipulative at times so that our squash also will be properly guided as to where they have to go so so this time around if you're going to observe the leaves here at the bottom it is smaller but when the the moment the squash reached the summit you can see here the span of the leaves it became so huge <laughs> okay so apart from the dead branch that we have established there there is a live <clears throat> kamachali here this tree kamachali tree was actually huge and it has plenty of branch branches this one and then that one and then that one and seeing actually that the growth of this kamachali gave or caused damage in in the wall here this is actually the wall of our neighbor and it has lots of cracks here so I did wait for our neighbor to to say that you have to cut it but I myself did did the cutting here so I cut this one okay and I utilized some of its branch of course to uh, to support our plantation here and that is why we have a structure and I could say that this is strong because there is also another live you know kamachili tree here that serves also as our support system here and it even extends towards the entrance this is the one thing so towards that entrance so it became our de decoration here and that's nice <laughs> this squash really is crossing from that corner towards this area really it is looking for the sun so I'll just allow it to happen because there are still spaces here for this squash to fill in so that is that is okay it is not an issue at all for this squash to just grow in that manner we will just allow that squash to grow in that manner we also have bonsai type of squash here and we're just very patient to take care of them this squash although bonsai in type they still have the right to live and to grow so we're just very patient in taking good care of them although it turns to be yellowish right now and uh, seem to be having problem with the liver <laughs> if it's like human I mean if it become yellowish they have liver problem maybe liver cirrhosis but this one although there is a a shade here yet it started to recover and that is why I just need to some kind of guide them to have a re as to where they have to go 
and it seems that it's already recovering and on the way towards giving us an impression that hey don't underestimate us don't underestimate me i have the capacity to grow and if that is the case then i'll take care of this one